We were tired of beating up on each other, so we finally, you know, get prepared to beat up on someone else. And, uh, you know, we just going out, preparing. It's a little different. You know, Coach did a great job getting us ahead of schedule with the, how he wants practice done and being, you know, practicing in the afternoon. But, uh, you know, we just want to come out, prepare, execute, and, and we think that um, we should be successful if we do that. You've had a little more time now to see some Western tape. What do you think about them? Um, I mean, I think they're, you know, pretty, pretty decent team. Um, they like to fly around. You know, they got a... Uh, they got a pretty good linebacker back there that lot like um to make a lot of tackles. So um you know, we just got to go out there and execute and um, you know, be make some plays. How much of an unknown is, is that team? I mean obviously you've seen them the last two years, but it's not gonna look the same. Right. It's 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 more of like we we understand the personnel but like uh the, with the coaching staff being out of the year, both the defensive coordinator and the head coach. It's hard for the coaches to really give us what they're gonna what they're gonna do, but I mean, so they, in practice they're throwing a lot of things at us, and then um, so we're looking just to be prepared for anything. That's just you know the unknown and that fact that you know we don't know exactly what's gonna be there because we don't have any game. We had game for two years ago that we've been studying and watching that we're you know we're gonna take in there and some other things that coach is doing in there that you know that won't catch us off guard because he's gonna try to prepare us for everything. So which team are you watching? Uh, in terms of scheme wise, which team are you <laughs> watching? To, to um, we just the um, the I think that he was the coordinator at Washington, so um, that's what we're taking, you know, looking at. But we're looking at a lot of different things that across the board. Coach is just you know throwing a lot of stuff at us that that um, we should you know be prepared for. And if anything, you know, this football game, Coach Scott always tells us. It's a game of adjustment, so uh, we get down there and we just see something different. We have to adjust and continue to, you know, go out there, execute, and make plays. Does this Monday before first game feel different than last year's? Um, it's a little different because by now we would have been practicing. <laughs> so, uh, you know, it's an afternoon practice. But, um, I mean, um, we I mean, we were excited. Last year we were excited. But, I mean, this year guys are excited. We're you know, we're focused, we, we feel good, you know, we're a lot healthier than we were last year. We, I think we're close to 100% with everyone being back. And, uh, I mean, we just, you just, um, just know that we have to go out there and just, you know, prepare well, and if we prepare well, we, we know that we can be successful. Do you, Do you like that change that he made? You mentioned the afternoon practices. For all this time, it's been <laughs> early mornings. But, yeah. But Mark said he wants you guys rested. Has that worked? Do you, um, do you like the, the um, it has worked. This whole camp, he's been doing a great job of, uh, you know, giving us time away from football, rest our bodies, rest our mind. And then I think guys are, you know, performing well. Guys aren't. As sluggish, you know, in the morning, some people are just, it's just not morning people that, you know, that, that aren't able to just go out there and just perform well in practice because they're just not a morning person. But, you know, being able to come out there in the afternoon, you woke, you've been through the day, and, and so it, it just helps out. You know, everyone's rested, everyone's, you know, rejuvenated. So um, we do we do like it, and um, we just keep working with it. We don't know if there's going to be any changes or anything, but we've been working with it now. This team is counting a lot on you. How, how healthy did you get through camp? Um, I was very healthy through camp. Um, didn't have really any nags or anything. Um, I, um, they did, the coach you know, said, did a great job. I set out some scrimmages, but uh, I mean, I didn't have anything really big that that was, you know, everyone was just going to have any minor things. But, you know, the ice ice tub, little treatment here and there, and I'll be fine. So I think I should be healthy. Chomping at the bit then a little bit? It sounds like they sort of pulled back on you to, to keep you healthy, get you to game day. Yeah, I'm, Are you gonna be I'm definitely uh, ready. To, you know, I'm definitely ready You know, go in and bang some people and make some plays with my teammates, you know, watching them on the field and seeing all those guys make those plays. And, you know, you just out there, you get anxious, you start rubbing your hands together because you see, you know, guys out there just – you want to be out there with those guys, you know, catching those balls and jump on, making those big runs, and all the running backs just out there making plays. And you're just like, man, I got to get out there. So this week is very, very exciting for me. I'm very excited to be out there. Uh, yeah. It has been. It's been a long off season. It's been exciting. Um, you know, we're just ready to go. I mean, both sides of the ball, new staffs, new, new styles of play. I mean, first half on Saturday, do you even know what to expect? Or is it just going to be a game of adjustments, really? Uh, you know, we're they're getting us prepared for everything. Um, what we could see, what we might see, what we might not see, but we're we're gonna be ready for everything. We, because um, like like you said, the the staffs that are there now hadn't been coaching in a year or two, and so they could change it up. You know, we, but we'll be ready for it.
How far along is this offensive line in terms of you know, getting on the same page with each other? How much did you guys get done during camp? Uh, uh, we did very well. Again, you know, um, we had a few guys get injured and a few guys rotating in and out, and we seem to we seem to pick it up a lot more towards the middle to end of camp and. Uh, we did, we did really well communicating and picking things up. How happy were you for Max Godby when you got that news last week? Man, he's a, that's great. Um, he's a hard worker, great guy, on and off the field, good leader, role model. He deserved it. There's been sort of this vibe since Mark Stoops got here that this is a new era in Kentucky football. How important is this first game then to, that, to getting that era off on the right foot? Uh, it's very important. Why? What, what, how, how, what can that do for this program to, just to start week one with a new coach and, and go out and, and deliver a good performance? Uh, it could set the tone for the whole season. You know, we could, uh, if we perform well, execute well, I mean, give us a lot more confidence going into the rest of the season and give the fan base some confidence in us. And uh, it's just, it's really important. Do you guys feel better prepared to, to go win a game in week one than you did a year ago this time? I believe so. Yeah, more mentally wise. Yes, yeah, absolutely. So? Um, Coach and staff, they've they've done a good job of uh, getting us good rest, uh, making sure if we're injured, taking care of us. They're getting people in, talking to us uh, to show us how to get ready mentally before a game, during practice, and how to push through things. And you know, y'all have heard of all the new technology we all have, and I mean that stuff is just unbelievable how much it helps. So. Do you think it'll work? I mean, it's oh, all I, sort of untested right, at this point. I, mean, I already know. It. It'll work. It does work. Kevin, just in terms of how much positive energy there is around the program as opposed to last year when there was a lot of negativity, does that impact the players? Do you guys feel that? Oh, yeah, absolutely. We, we love uh, how the fan base is behind us now. And, uh, you know, it's, it's a good feeling. It's a great feeling. Do you think it makes it easier to play well? Or? Um, well, I mean, anytime you have a big – I mean, you're, if you, uh, I'm sorry, um, pack your pack your stadium. I mean, it makes it hard for any team coming in, or you know, in Nashville, I'm sure it's gonna be a great UK crowd, and it's gonna be it's gonna be fun to play in front of. So.